My name's Akemia Minot. Um, I'm a youth worker. I've done youth work for about 20 years in Mosside. And recently, over the past couple of years, we've developed a youth-led organisation um, to respond to serious youth violence and post-traumatic stress that young people experience from that. Because um, we didn't think there was enough happening around it. Um, on the 8th of August, 2017, the, a, joint, a joint enterprise trial was coming to an end and a lot of young men had got charged with one murder. Uh, so I'd resigned from my job so I could support these young men and their families as this was happening. We got the verdicts on the 8th of the 8th, which is why we're called 8 for Youth. And also uh, two groups of other young men from another area came to my side and attacked as many young men as they could see. They basically chased all the young men that were out, who were out grieving the fact that they'd lost their friends to joint enterprise murder charges. And they killed another young man and three other young men got seriously injured. Um, so my initial idea was to link up with another youth worker and just do workshops around serious youth violence. But young people that I'd worked with for so long that had witnessed murders, been devastated about the friends getting charged with joint enterprise knowing that they'd not actually killed anyone but they were going to be doing 20 years in prison they kind of became part of the, it kind of evolved into this team of young people and me um so now we're doing workshops around youth violence we're doing detached work and we do center-based work and it's just all to engage in people in positive stuff and encourage more positive choice, learning about themselves, learning about their place in society and like counteracting the negative stereotypes that are placed on our community, which everyone will have seen. So I'm Javon, I'm part of 84 Youth and um, well nothing's actually well not nothing actually happened to me but I've been there and around when stuff have happened in my community. Um, how old was I? A lot of things happened from a young age, so like from the start, like high school, 14, 15, ongoing, and that's it really. Um, why, I'm, why I'm in it? Because I want to, I want to be part of the, I want to be that part of the community part of our country to, to be able to say well when everything does cut down when youth violence does stop and stuff like that I can say that I was there from the beginning and I put my work in and, and I was part of that team. It, that, that it's well with my situation it was all one group and it was like two people have fallen out and it was like well I'm on this, I'm choosing his side, I'm choosing his side. And it was like, it came down to like, everyone choose a side. So it was like one big friendship group and it was like, two people fell out, everyone choose a side and everyone had chose their sides. And that's where it came to like, that's how it started, yeah. Tell them it's not worth it. If you're friends, don't let it get to that. Like, it's it's not worth it at all. You're gonna, then, then stuff's gonna happen. Like in my situation, People were, people were killed and it's weird because you look back at it and say, oh, four years ago I was in pictures with this guy and now he's in jail for killing the same guys in pictures with and stuff like that. It's, 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 it's weird. It's, it, that's what will mess with your, your, your head a bit more because it's like, oh, just over a week or just over a year, I was, at, I was at home with this guy in my house and stuff like that. So I don't think it's worth it. If you've got your friends or even if you said, all right, I'm not going to speak to them again. It doesn't have to come down to violence or anything to say, well, if we see them, it's going to be this and it's going to be that. Just leave it as it is. If you don't want to speak to someone, don't speak to them. But it never needs to get to violence because that was... Violence was... What did they say? Um, fire on fire doesn't... It doesn't... So you can't fight fire with fire in it. So there's no point. Obviously, it was a surprise because nothing like that had happened in in my friendship group before. So it was like, and there was a build up to it anyway. So it was like, it, but it was a short build up. So everything had happened in like the space of a few minutes, and it was like, who's running? Everyone was running, and 
you could hear you could hear like people scuffling and that imagine we're all running together then you're looking back and you're on your own so it's like where where's everyone else gone and then when everything's calmed down everyone's coming out of like over there you come out from over there and then some people ain't coming out so you're like so where's so and so where's where's my cousin and then you then you go into gardens and people are on the floor bleeding and stuff like that so it's like your heart starts obviously you've been running and obviously when you say running for your life we're actually was like running for our life because if we if we didn't run that could have been us we didn't know it was gonna go as bad as it did so it was like that same day or the right my my closest friends they had gone on that another murder trial and then they had been sentenced but that whole through that whole thing i like i even stopped going court so at first i, start, I was going court and i was like no i can't i can't because i used to get like i used to get upset seeing my friends there so kid mad because i know that they hadn't done they hadn't killed anyone so it was just like oh this is just well, obviously in them situations i can't I'm not in a position to help anyone in that situation, so I didn't even, I didn't even know how to go about that situation. It was more of a, um, it is what it is situation with that one. So someone had been killed, but um, there was a group, so a group of my friends, so there was like a group of my friends, and then another group of people they would say were affiliated with. They weren't, the other group wasn't my friends, so say there was, I think there was like 12, say six were my friends and the other six wasn't my friends but we all knew each other and someone had been killed and everyone got done for the murder like some got attempted and i mean some got manslaughter and some got murder but obviously it was only one person what did the murder it's the joint enterprise um is it the lot i don't know joint enterprise thing but um yeah, that's what they were working off the Joint Enterprise and obviously they kept bringing the gang narrative into it so it made it look worse. It looked like they were one big gang. So, and the way the police put that the whole case together, like the, the defence team, like, they made it out like this gang had planned to do this, like go out and kill someone that day. So that's why they got that Joint Enterprise and that's why it looked so bad. But it wasn't, it was nothing like they made it out to be. I avoid it. I have to go that way to go shopping and I will drive the long way around so I don't have to see that spot because every time I go past either spot, it's like someone's punched me in my stomach. It's like whingy or you just, it's not anything you ever forget. And it's so easy yeah, yeah. to replay the whole scene in your head from start to finish when you were there. It, 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 the impact of it, it's not worth getting involved in. It's really not. It, it's however like much of a man you think it makes you however grown it thinks you make the consequences of these choices last forever you yeah. never ever ever move past it it's always there and you can like talking about it now i can feel it's almost like i'm feeling what i was feeling at the time and the impact it has on your, on your actual body and your physical well-being yeah, yeah. That level of trauma, Javon. It's like you're not, you, you don't know what's happening to your body. Do you? Yeah. It, it, it just cons it consumes you.